breaking news, a terror attack in Africa. That's right, a suicide bomber setting off explosives in Tunis, Tunisia, injuring at least two officers. ABC's Ian Pamel starts us off with the very latest. Good morning, Ian. Yeah, good morning, Amy. Breaking news from the Tunisian capital, where two suicide attacks have taken place this morning. The first happened near the French embassy when a suicide bomber detonated his belt. The second incident happened only a mile away and also involved a suicide attacker. The Interior Ministry is reporting one policeman dead and another injured, at least five others also wounded. Counter-terrorism police are on the scene and a reminder that this is a country with a long history of terrorist-related violence. Tunisia is among the top recruiting grounds for ISIS fighters. In 2015, two attacks, one at the National Museum, left 22 people, mostly European tourists, dead, and another took place on a seaside resort on a beach where 38 mainly British tourists were murdered by a terrorist gunman on the beach. The U.S. Embassy say they're monitoring the situation and advising American citizens to stay indoors. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.